Hey, my name is Kushdeep Singh. I'm introducing our paper on predicting future occupancy grids in dynamic environment with spatial temporal learning. We generate occupancy grid maps from nuisance data set and superimpose the corresponding 3D bounding boxes. Then we pass these grids into a spatial temporal network to generate future three second predictions. We demonstrate different types of real world scenarios present in the data set. Vehicle objects of interest are labeled as green while the rest of the environment is represented as blue. In our pipeline, we initially separate the occupancies characterized by vehicles from the environment. These are later fed into two parallel streams of spatial temporal networks that are trained simultaneously for generating future three second predictions. One of the sample scenarios is shown wherein multiple vehicles are moving in forward direction. We consider past eight frames as input to our networks. Here we present qualitative comparison of red RNN and on LSTM networks with respect to ground truth. For the depicted scenario, it is crucial that the model predicts vehicles along with free space in the drivable area. Red RNN can retain small obstacles up to future two seconds, while Connell team fails to retain these crucial smaller things. Similarly, in this scenario, we have few static vehicles and the vehicle is moving in the reverse direction. Red RNN shows the vehicle in the environment for entire three second prediction horizon, while Connell team fails to predict the vehicle even two seconds into the future. Conclusion, we present a pipeline for producing long-term occupancy grid predictions of the urban environment in the case of dynamic eco-vehicle. Spatial temporal networks were able to forecast the position of dynamic objects under different traffic scenarios. Our occupancy grid maps are based on nuisance data set and include several real world urban traffic conditions. We publicly release this data set for further enhancement in occupancy grid maps based research domain.